very, very exciting stuff going on over there at Juma with those wonderful leopards. And I think it's really quite interesting that Shongile and Tandi have ended up in the same sighting. They seem to have had a little bit of conflict before. Uh, sisters they are, of course. Anyway, I'm not sure how many sisters there are in that lot there. That, of course, is a sounder of warthogs, and they're sitting, as you can see, in the wide open clearings here. We're now in the very northwestern section of the Masai Mara National Reserve, which is a little bit distinct from the Mara Triangle, which is across the Mara River, where Scott is now. It's all, of course, part of one giant ecosystem. And in the way in the background, purple, you can see in the middle of your screen, is the Olololo Escarpment, where, of course, we are going to be heading when we eventually get home. Somewhere above that tree, I imagine. That lone tree there. Uh, and then we have got a few other things just around here at the moment. We've got a Thompson's Gazelle. And you see them there, Fergus? Yeah. Two Thompson's gazelles? They're not actually Thompson's at all, they're Thompson's. And they are very relaxed. That looks like a little... ...with its mum. Having a little bit of a graze. Now, what I think is quite interesting around here, if we... ...pan of the grasslands, if you like. There I am. Hello. Uh, have we, as we look across these clearings here, I think is how short this grass is in comparison with the grass out where, for example, where Scott is. And what is interesting is that it's it's much shorter than by something, and we're not far from a number of villages, so it could have been cattle. It looks to me like there hasn't been a tremendous amount of rain in this area, but what I wonder is if perhaps that great big herd of wildebeest that we saw today is not going to come up this far and that it is going to be diverted by the much longer grasses of the area just around the Mara Triangle. Okay, I think you're losing signal with me. Let's head back across to Tristan and those wonderful leopards.